gameplay. Actually, no, this is my first Sims gameplay, so yeah. Aha. Uh -huh. Anyway, um, this is my gaming channel officially, and I have another channel. It's just King Kind of Gamer. This one's KLC Games. So, yeah, let's get right in. Introducing all the Sims characters. As you see, I already started playing, already started building, but I'm not finished, so yeah. This is like a roommate house, kind of like all they all live here together, and they're all friends. Some of them, there are a couple of married couples here, and we'll get to that in a minute. So first things first, we have this dude. I forgot his name, but we're going to go to Simology so I can tell you all about him. His name is Everett. Yeah, if I spelled that wrong or spelled that, said that wrong, please put it down in the comments. He's materialistic, he's a snob, business savvy, and neat. You know, he's one of the more stuck up guys, and you know, and that stuff. He is also married to Joanne, who is more, you know, goody goody, like ambitious, you know, loves her food, loves outdoors, you know. Then we have Elliot over here, he is romantic, creative, music lover unemployed by the way I'm calling E for now on E the materialistic dude the curly blonde hair he is working in business and Joanne I have no idea what she is but we'll see because you know I didn't create her he married her even though I mailed this game I built this gameplay just yesterday all right I'm gonna go on to Jasmine, she is married to Freddie, and she is unemployed for a reason. I'll get to that. Family orientated, foodie, and romantic. She is a uh, working in the food business, like she's a chef. Yeah. So, oh, not her. That's someone else. No, but she likes food. Yeah. Stacy, Stacy, she's the more mischief person in the house. She is a criminal full-time only gets nine dollars an hour which is crazy she makes the lowest income in the house i believe besides the two that don't have jobs which is elliot and jasmine she's lazy you know self-assured you know she she's a bad bad person then we have your friend freddie over here which is jasmine's husband and he is a tech guru makes the highest money income in the house romantic goofball cheerful you know Israel, pretty sure I said his name right. He is a secret agent, he's romantic, genius, and active. So, yeah. And then last but not least, we have Shyla. Pretty sure I said that right. We're not gonna get into it that much. She's a writer. She's more the humble person in the house. More, you know, calm. She's a bookworm, goofball, creative. You know, yeah. So we're gonna get more into depth. Jasmine does not work because she's family orientated and wants, because someone is gonna move out in one episode. They, her and Freddie are probably gonna have a kid. Yeah. Elliot is unemployed because he owns this place. He is friends with everyone in the place. Except for Joanna, you know, they really just started to meet. And he, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, he is brothers with Freddy. Might be completely wrong. Yeah, brother. Brother. He is brothers with Freddy. Yeah. So, yeah, that's that. And that's why they don't, they both don't have a job. Now let's just move over to Joanna for a second because, like I said, we don't really know too much about her. She has no job. Okay, so she will get a job. She wants to own a mansion. Well, she has the same kind of aspiration as her husband, so both kind of stuck up. No, not really too stuck up though. So in this gameplay, we're just going to see everything, how everything goes, and what happens. Obviously, I'm not done building the house, as you saw the two, three top floors. 
Um, but yeah. I think she'll be an entertainer. She kind of looks like an entertainer. She wants to be famous, you know, have the lifestyle. Anyway. So let's get here. I'm going to pause the gameplay for a second and show you the house one by one and explain what everything means and what everything is briefly over here we have the office we have six desks even though there's more than six people in the game I might add two three more desks but right now there's only six desks and on the desk they have certain things like on this desk they have Everyone has a tablet, so everyone has a tablet, but there's a camera here. On this desk, they have a tablet, a camera, and a sketch pad, you know, sketch pad, tablet, camera, you know, all that. And some people have two cameras, like the old-fashioned camera, the new camera, and a tablet, so yeah. Then we'll move on, so this is the entertainment room. They have their games, their fireplace, music, you know, smart speakers, they got their couches, you know, things like that got their books for the bookworm also people that just need to learn things and then you got creative things because like I said maybe one day there will be kids in this house they got their indoor gym their chess their cards like, there's no chairs to that I don't know why they're you know musical things they got the mic you know stuff like that so this, is, this right here is actually forgot your name sir Elliot's room. This is his room. He lives downstairs. This whole place is his, but he's just letting people live here for now until the upstairs gets, you know, put together. As you can tell, this place, I built this place, and the kitchen was only this big. Spread it out. This was the bathroom. This was the living area. You know, this, none of this was here. None of this was here. This was a kid's room. I don't know who died, but you know, someone died. You know, this was the bathroom, kids' bathroom, obviously. I added this, no, this floor was already here. This was only this piece right here. There's a hole in the floor, I have to fix that. And this wasn't even here at all. So, yeah. This is this place, and the kitchen is actually very nice, I think. They don't always eat together, but when they do, they have lots of tables even if they have guests over for like a party anything like that and so yeah they also have a microwave you know dual sinks stuff like that because there's so many different people here so many different things to do they need quite a bit of things also cupcake machine why not they got their little bar over here gotta fix the tiles but besides that yeah this is their house and before we start playing the game I just want to tell you where everyone's gonna live like I said Elliot sleeps right here it's gonna be two families or two people per, per floor so this will be split up between Jasmine and Freddie they're gonna live together and another person is gonna be Israel they're all three of them are gonna live on this floor on the next floor it's gonna be, yeah, him and Joanna, so them, and it's gonna be Shyla. And then on the next floor, it's gonna be Jasmine. Oh, I know, it's gonna be Stacy. Just Stacy. Okay, so I feel like we can move people around. We'll come up with something. And there's like maybe a guest room or something like that. Yeah, maybe. Okay. So right now this is all their bed. You know they all have stuff. Have to add another dual bed because there's another married couple here. But yeah, so let's get playing. So right now I'm gonna play as E, which is his new name. I kind of want them all to like sit together. Uh, 
don't actually know which TVs they're all watching, so. Watch TV. And then whoever can win, join in and stuff like that. Yeah, so we're all just like, get together and shit. Yeah. Everyone's coming to watch TV. Man, those booty shorts not working for you. Okay, maybe we should make sure everyone's here. Not everyone got up. Okay, yeah. If you want to know, I didn't pick any of these styles, I just know what the best they were, randomized characters, pick style, I didn't want to do anything, so I just randomized, name, randomized, inspirations I did pick, but that's pretty much it. Okay, so some people went off and doing their own thing, some people went back to sleep, some people are watching TV, socializing, so basically you all know who are introverts are versus are extrovert who are you are you oh you're him I'm like I didn't know you were that bald okay anyways yeah so people are getting their things done really have to change that this is really messing me up right here okay Are you okay? You're not really staring at anything. What's your name again? I think you're her, right? Okay, so you can go somewhere. Are you gonna take a nap on the couch? I don't know what you're gonna do. You just moved over to one end. Oh no, you're tired. Okay. Makes sense, even though it doesn't say that you're tired. So I never actually got to use these, so I'm gonna see what they do. Classic painting. I just realized you're not the creative one, you're the mischief one, so let's see how much we can paint her. Artiste. Like you're trying to in my way, I want to see what you're doing. <laughs> oh, going all over the place. It kind of looks like a, a cat of some sort. Is that a pig? What? Um, hmm. No, is that a baby? What is that? Oh, it's a dog. Oh! I'm looking at it completely wrong. Why is that a bear? I don't know what it is, per se, but maybe it's a dog. Kind of, kind of looks like a dog, but it kind of looks like a bear. Don't really know what that was, but it's fine. <sighs> oh, it's Toby. No, we're gonna make you take a picture. No, you know something. Mm. Mm. Maybe you could be like the one person that like sneaks up on people and takes embarrassing pictures of them. Let's do that. Okay. Can you not take a picture of them? Okay, well, I want you to take a picture of these people. Sounds weird. I know. Take a photo of Israel. Why not? Let's do it. Untitled. Okay, well, we're going to name it Moo. Moo moo. Yeah, makes perfect sense. Beautiful. Can we sell that? Yeah, we're gonna sell that. You got $89. That seems nice. Did you take a picture of Israel? What? No, I don't know. The world may never know who you took a picture of. 
if you took a picture of him. Take photo with. He's real. Okay, let's see. Actually, canceled. I want to take a photo. Let's see how this works. I mean, I should probably follow you. Is he upstairs? You know how I feel about when people go upstairs to our ugly. No, second floor. Child's potty. They leave. Oh, wow. It's a little bit ugly, but it's fine. Actually, kind of scared me a little bit. Oh, wait, no. What do I do? Did he not take a photo? <sighs> Disgusting. I think I pressed the wrong button. Take a photo with Israel. Yes. Kenaya. Andy. Ooh, even worse. Okay, well. Ooh. Oh, I actually like this one. Try not to get your armpit in the picture because oh, the soap. We don't want that. Maybe another one. Let's go with creepy, but yet satisfying. Let's like zoom in on that mustache. Yes. So yeah, we zoomed in on the mustache. We're, we're gonna, are we gonna zoom in? No, you don't have a mustache. It's not worth it. Old timey. Zooming on the mustache. Or maybe the eyebrows. Look at those eyebrows. Alright. I think we're done here. Yeah, we did like fantastic. Those photos. 10 out of 10. What we're gonna do is take your photos. I don't know where you're gonna be, so we're gonna take these photos and we're gonna put them on the wall. How do you do that? I actually, mm. That's sad. That I don't know how to place photos on the wall. Do I like kind? Mm. No, I don't want to set filter. Do I name them? Is that how you put them on the wall? GG, I don't know why I've named it that, but that's its name now. Uh, mm. Can I like, drag? Is that not a thing? Oh, press square. Okay. This is going to be the photo wall. Loving it. I make loving it right now. Okay. Let's look at these beautiful portraits. Why is there a gnome in that photo? There was not a gnome when I took that. I feel uncomfortable now. That's a little creepy. I knew the mustache was evil. Little mustache. Little mustache. You can't trust mustaches. Alright, I mean, that's cool. That's cool. Well, let's see. Maybe he wants to take a picture with his brother. Let's have a brotherly picture. Mm. Let's have you grab a camera first. Stop your sleeping. No one wants to sleep. You're ugly. No, let me change my mind about that. Not that ugly. You're kind of ugly. No, you're not. You're actually not. <laughs> no, you don't want to sleep. You want to wake up your brother and take a family photo. Did you grab the camera? Like I so, so <laughs> pleasingly asked you to. Shoot, Simba. <laughs> Do both of you have to pee or something like that? No, you're hungry. He had to pee. <sighs> okay, you grab the camera. I want you to. 
before you eat, I want you to take a, po a photo. Yes, take a photo. Woo, love photos. Take a photo of you and your brother Freddy. Actually, I actually have to find you after. I want to see these moments. I need to capture these moments. Oh, ooh, what a creepy face. Why do you guys like your armpits in the photos? I don't get it. Let's have a normal photo. Don't have one of these. Don't just get real close. Zoom in on the mustache. Let's just get one of only you. Because, and like half of your brother's face. Because why not? Yeah. And let's get a nice one of your brother looking creepy. And you're just staring at him. Uh -huh. Nice. Now before you go eat. Actually, I think you could eat without me. Like while I'm doing this. Okay, well this is the photo wall and this is what we have. We have nice, nice, beautiful family photos. Oh, okay, there's no more. Okay, well, let's look at these. Mmm, looks normal. Looks normal as it can get for the Sims. Looks normal. Oh, I'm at the house. That's not normal. And there's like gnomes in these. Why is there gnomes? Is it because it's circling on one person? That kind of seems like the pattern, even though I don't know where the gnomes come from. It's fine. Everyone's doing their own thing. And yeah. So, I think this episode was life fulfilling. You got to learn everyone's personality traits. You got to know about everyone, even though I don't remember half their names. Next episode, we'll start to build on the house and just make this game ten times better with a beautiful masterpiece. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. And yeah, you should do that. Because, yeah.